Welcome to another video. This is a bit of a trial. It's a new format. Please let me know in the comments what you think about it and I hope you enjoy it. So we are here at the uh, Crete du Jura. Down there is the airport of Geneva and Geneva behind the Salève. It's a super unstable day. It's quite humid, so it has rained until the morning. So cloud base is super, super low. Um, but it's going quite well. So we have some northwest wind, so this makes everything a bit tricky. Um, we don't have it really on the slope here because there is the thermals that come up. But up high in the altitude there is some northwest and this pushes out the thermals um, towards the flats. And this creates a bit of shade on the ridge as you can see here. So we have uh, good clouds but there is also a lot of shade so I have to be careful not to get stuck in the shade in between. But overall, I think in this section here, it's a good closed ridge. And this actually looks really, really good. I think um, here we should be able to make some fast, fast kilometers. And uh, so the goal is to fly to the Grand Colombier, uh, which is kind of visible behind the dark cloud there at the end. And then we will try to fly back towards Ansi and come back towards Villeneuve. But uh, let's see how it goes. It's quite ambitious, base is low. It's a cool day, cool to be back in this region. I used to live four years down there in Geneva. And uh, yeah, it's good to be back. <laughs> push out here a bit towards the cloud you can see how the um, it's a bit lifty there's some wisps underneath the black cloud so I think the lift is actually there so I'm heading out a bit because close to the slope there's a lot of shade so often you find a bit more the climbs outside on the other hand it's also a bit tricky because the airspace is quite close and um, yeah, so down there is the Geneva airport and there is a quite a close airspace line kind of halfway up this ridge. So I have to stay in the back side of the ridge actually to not breach airspace. Ooh la la, you can see there's a lot of shade ahead. Good cloud, but also a lot of shade. So let's see how we go. It should be possible still to, to manage, but yeah, it's it's, we will have to be fly a bit uh, and, and use a bit of tricks maybe. So yeah, I have a very weak thermal, but there is some sun underneath me and there's a lot of shade ahead. So I will try to actually milk it to the max and really climb up. So in order to not get caught out by the shade. And uh, the big problem here is once the shade, but also the airspace. So. If there wouldn't be any airspace, it would be super easy. You would just follow the cloud a bit more outside of the ridge, more towards the flats. But this is not an option here, so because there is a, a thousand meters altitude limit above the flats, and just along the ridge line here, we can actually fly at uh, 2,000 meters. But uh, so, yeah, this really obliges me to climb. OK, 
Okay, so I don't really can climb much higher, so I will try to stick to the terrain and get some dynamic lift on the terrain. Let's see how that works. Mm -hmm. 